Hi, my name is Laura Abate, and I'm the Associate Director of Library Operations at Himmelfarb Library. Today, I want to show you our Integrative Medicine Resources page. From the library's homepage, you'll see an area for research guides, and I'm going to search that area for the term integrative. This pulls up our Integrative Medicine Research Guide. You'll see the guide is organized into three columns. On the left, you have core books, in the center, research articles databases, and on the left side, therapeutic databases. In the core books area, you'll see links to several key textbooks, all of which are available in full text online format from the Himmelfarb Library. I'm going to link to the first, Integrative Medicine. This pulls up the book, and I'm able to view each chapter of the book in either full text, either in an HTML format or a PDF format. Many of our ebook vendors provide us PDF chapter copies, although not all. I'm back at our Integrative Medicine Research Guide and would like to talk a little bit about the research articles databases. The first listing here is PubMed at Himmelfarb. PubMed at Himmelfarb is a customized version of the PubMed database. We've customized it in a couple different ways. One, here on the left, you'll see my NCBI filters. We've customized our filters to reflect an evidence-based practice approach to the health sciences literature. We've also customized PubMed at Himmelfarb with full text links. In this case, you'll see two different types of links. Here you're seeing LiveKey Nomad links in dark blue, and a little bit later, you'll see Find It at Himmelfarb links in a lighter blue. Looking at several specific articles in the Systematic Reviews section, I wanted to highlight the LiveKey Nomad links. LiveKey Nomad is what we consider a full text accelerator, so it's trying to get you as quickly as possible to the full text, ideally a PDF. So in cases like this first article, where it can immediately deliver a PDF, you'll see a download PDF link. For other articles, we may have the full text or be able to get it for you via one of our document delivery services, and in those cases, you'll see an article link icon. You'll still likely get the full text here, but it may require another link or two. I've just scrolled down a bit on the Integrative Medicine Resources page. On the left, you'll see additional links for core journals, and in the middle of the page, another research database called Scopus, which is useful if you need to expand your research. Below Scopus, you'll see information instructions on LiveKey Nomad, so you can install this browser extension on your computer. Back on the Integrative Medicine Resources page, I wanted to now talk about the databases in the left-hand column and start with natural medicines. Natural medicines is an authoritative evidence-based database. You can search it numerous ways, including by natural medicine agent or for a specific product or by indication. I'm going to walk you through some of natural medicines features and tools by searching for peppermint oil. Here, you can see the search results, and we'll note that the results include a mix of commercial products, as well as professional monographs on agents, like peppermint, and interventions, like aromatherapy. I'm going to select the professional monograph for peppermint. At the top of the page, you'll see links for patient handouts on peppermint, plus navigation to the sections of the material provided. You'll also see identifying information for the agent including its scientific name and family. I've navigated to the adverse effects section, and you'll see there is general information, as well as information regarding the most common adverse effects. After that, you can explore adverse effects by dermatologic, gastrointestinal, or other categories. I'm going to select dermatologic. In this expanded view, you'll see more detailed information regarding possible dermatologic adverse effects of peppermint, and I want to specifically point out the numeric hyperlinks. 
Natural Medicines is an evidence-based resource, and these links can connect you to the research articles which provide the supporting information in these statements. If I click on the first hyperlink for the number 3802, I land in the reference list with that citation highlighted. I can continue to follow the links to get more information on the article, as the View Abstract link will connect me to the article citation in PubMed. From here, I can use either the LiveKey Nomad link, which is a little hidden in this view, or the Find It at Himmelfarb link to view the full text of this article. Back in Natural Medicines and moving down the sections of the article, I skip the safety section to show you effectiveness. You'll see that Natural Medicines organizes the information via an internal system, so you see entries under headings for likely effective, possibly effective, etc. If you expand the details for any indication, you'll see additional detailed information, including the citation information. At any point, you can also click on the headers for an explanation of what is meant by these categories. Here, I'll click on Likely Effective to get a description of the evidence which underlies that category. This page explains the categories and shows you the type of research that lend themselves to the different categories, i.e. randomized controlled trials, meta-analyses, epidemiologic studies, etc as well as the evaluation of those studies for bias and validity. I'm skipping the dosage and administration section to the drug interaction section. Right off the bat, you'll note some color coding here with the yellow and green headers for interaction rating. Below those, you'll see there's additional information regarding the severity of the interaction, the likelihood of an occurrence of the interaction, and the level of evidence for the interaction. Once again, explanatory information for each of those ratings is available by clicking on the heading itself. In addition to the monographs, I want to show you some of the tools available. Natural Medicines provides an interaction checker. Here you can see I've put in peppermint as well as two different drugs and a food, grapefruit. Natural Medicines identified two possible interactions, both related to atorvastatin or Lipitor. Each provides an interaction rating as well as the option to view the details of that interaction. Another tool is an effectiveness checker. This allows me to start at a diagnosis rather than a specific agent or product. Here I've searched irritable bowel syndrome and I'm getting results that give me a brief information on the agent as well as its effectiveness rating. Natural Medicines also provides a tool to assess for possible issues with nutrient depletion. And another tool to check for possible safety issues during pregnancy and lactation. Finally, the Adverse Effects tool allows you to start from a specific adverse reaction and explore possible causes of that reaction. And that concludes this brief demonstration of natural medicines. Some key points to remember about this database are that it's an evidence-based tool in which you will find transparency between statements and the evidence and studies that provide that information. You should also note the transparency between ratings and the types and quality of evidence and studies that underlie those ratings. I've stopped briefly at our Integrative Medicines page before moving into Lexicomp, the next database under therapies. Lexicomp is our most comprehensive drug database. It searches a number of constituent indexes and information sources and I'll briefly navigate to its index page to show you why I'm demonstrating this database. Among its resources, Lexicon provides access to the Natural Products Database. To get information from the Natural Products Database, you simply search Lexicon. 
and here I've entered a search for ginkgo biloba. From the search results page, I can simply click on the link beneath the database that I want to see, in this case, the Natural Products database. As with natural medicines, you'll see navigation to the different sections of the drug monograph on the left side. LexiComp provides you some additional fields and information that we didn't see in natural medicines, including botany, history, and chemistry. But it also has similarities. In the Uses and Pharmacology section, you can review the animal and clinical data for specific uses of ginkgo biloba. And, as with natural medicines, the references are hyperlinked, so you can cl click on each for more information about the studies supporting that piece of information. This will allow you to see the citation, and you can continue following those links to PubMed for a full citation, as well as full text linking. Here's the PubMed citation, again with the Leibke Nomad links, plus the Find It at Himmelfarb link among others. And finally, the full text of the article. LexiComp's Natural Products Database provides brief information on pregnancy and lactation, plus a link to additional information in another of LexiComp's databases. This concludes our brief tour of integrative medicine resources. If you have questions, please reach out to us at Himmelfarb Library. You are welcome to come by the library in person and can also reach us via phone, email, and chat. On this page, you'll see an Ask Us button in the upper right corner and can open that to chat with one of our reference staff. Thank you.